Part four to the trumpet. Some of you know me because I have visited you recently. Some of you don't know me at all. But now you do. I am here tonight to make a similar request, though it will not have to do with the sweat lodge that Golden Eagle has so beautifully asked for. The medium owns a trumpet. It's a symbol, but a very, very powerful symbol. I would suggest that those of you who can feel the benefit of it would one by one, a week at a time, borrow that trumpet and have it in your home. It will serve to show those of us, and there are so many of us, who are getting more and more involved in reaching out to you, that you would like some play. <laughs> oh, and we'll play. I'm not a poltergeist, but I can act like one. So, I suppose that you could do this by having something like a list and one by one take that trumpet and then give it to the next one. And it will accomplish a purpose. That's my simple suggestion. My great friend Fletcher also thinks it's a good idea. And I suggest you do it. If you know what's good for you. <laughs> what do we do with the trumpet? <laughs> Have it in your home. Somewhere out of the way. The best place you can think of. It will be like a magnet that will draw attention. And there are things that we can do to alter the infrastructure of your dwelling so it doesn't look like some kind of a concrete bunker and instead looks like clear panes of glass. Communication is the goal. And it will be the result. That's all. <laughs>